Today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a double dose of chaos! That's right, we're cracking open two MTG Unpacked chaos mystery boxes. So these are my vision for how a chaos mystery box should be. Let's introduce the patrons we have, You Mad Brown 99 and Emblazoned Aegis. So we're going to roll here for which box we get. So one through six for You Mad Bra, he gets number five. So we'll grab that one down to five here in Blaze and Angels. One to five, number two. So there we are. Let's get cracking. And the theme this month is angels. So we're hoping to get lots of angel pulls here. Let's get stuck into it. For you, Mad Bar ninety nine. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Okay. So we'll see what packs we have today for you, sir. Starting off with War of the Spark, Ravnica Allegiance, Ixalan. Ooh, very spicy angel there. Also get a angel token. We'll take a look at those in a moment. Born of the Gods, Avison Restored, and Modern Horizons. Okay, so we'll do them like that. We'll do this. We'll get our bland vegetables out of the way first. How about that? And then something like this. Okay, let's take a look at the foil here. So each box this month gets a foil angel. Let's boost that lighting a tad. There we go. So very nice indeed. Token creature angel 4-4 with flying and on the back you've got the full art. So these are the ones from Unstable. Very cool. And the main angel here we have. A Chroma Angel of Fury. Fantastic artwork. Let's get that in focus. Legendary Creature Angel 6648 Mana. Whoa. A Chroma Angel of Fury can't be counted. It has flying, trample, protection from white, protection from blue. And for a red, it gets plus one, plus zero until end of turn. It has morph, three and three red. You may play this face down as a 2 2 creature for three. Turn it face up any time for its morph cost. Fantastic artwork and foiling there. So very cool pull for you, Mad Bra 99. Let's move on. We'll have our Ixalan here, and the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. So we'll keep an eye out for the craziness. We have Skyblade of the Legion, Skittering Heart Stopper, Jewel Shot, Slash of Talons, Jade Guardian, One with the Wind. Sally's Keeper, Siren Lookout, Gifted, or not Gifted, Gilded Sentinel, that's right, Unfriendly Fire, and Uncommon's Raider's Wake, Sleek Schooner, Call to the Feast, and the rare is Waker of the Wilds, Creature Merfolk Shaman, 3-3 three, three for 4, so you pay X, 2 green, put X, plus 1, plus 1, counters on target land you control, that land becomes a 0-0 zero, zero elemental creature with haste, it's still a land. Okay, and Mountain and Merfolk token. So what is your favorite set out of the ones here? I'm guessing not too many people are gonna say Born of the Gods. Although we could get a spicy god pool here, which incidentally is the theme for the Chaos Boxes in January 2020, so stay tuned for that. Next up we have Satessan Starbreaker, Forsaken Drifters. Ooh, that's creepy. Reminds me of that new trailer for Theros Beyond Death. Exorciate, Scaring Sands, Chorus of the Tides, Nullify, Impetuous Sun Chaser, Culling Mark, Necrobite, Kragma Butcher, and Uncommon's Aishiox Adept, Archetype of Finality, Vortex Elemental, and Rare is Silent Sentinel. Creature Archon 4 6 for 7 with flying whenever it attacks. You may return target and enchantment card from your graveyard to the battlefield. So a dirty big flying lion. I think that's what that's supposed to be. A planes and a soldier token. Okay, Ravnica Allegiance. Looking for the shock lands here. Okay, we start off with Feral Marker. Knight of Sorrows. Rakdos Rastabout. The best guild. Steeple Creeper. Gruel Locket, Frenzied Aranx, Oars of Locket, Deface, and these goblins are getting up to some mischief. Skitter Eel, Wrecking Beast, Uncommon's Biogenic Upgrade, 
Wilderness Reclamation, that is a decent pull, I'll put that one aside. Code of Constraint, and rare is Tezer Karlov. Fantastic artwork here from Magali Villeneuve, Legendary Creature Human Advisor 2-4 for 4. If a creature dying causes a trigger ability of opponent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional time. Creature tokens you control have Vigilance and Lifelink. Alright, Ors of Gilgate and a Spirit Token. On to War of the Spark, looking for the crazy planeswalkers here. A rare or mythic would be nice indeed. We have War Screecher, Teferi's Time Twist, Arm Crop Invader, Bulwark Giant, Shriek Diver, Ward Scale Croc, he'll bite your whole body off. Yes, watch out for this fella. Uh, Boreal Grazer, Herald of the Dread Horde, Prismite. Giant Growth, Uncommon's Prison Realm, Gideon's Triumph, Good day, Planeswalker here, Sahili Sublime Artificer, I'll put that one in as well. And the rare is Pahelion 2. <laughs> okay, that's not the best, but let's read it anyway. A legendary artifact vehicle 5548 with flying first strike and vigilance. Whenever it attacks, create two 4 4 white angel creature tokens with flying and vigilance that are attacking. You can crew up for four. And a mountain. And a wolf token, so I could be wrong about that card. It could be absolutely fantastic. Leave a note in the comments if you believe that to be the case. Okay, now struggling to open. Averson Restored. Going along nicely with the angel theme this month. We have Heaven Ghoul Scarb. Soul Cage Fiend. Uncanny Speed. Lair Delve. Nastad Scrapper. Geist Snatch. Ghoul Flesh. Raging Poltergeist, Joint Assault, Necrobite, and Uncommon's Rush of Blood, Homicidal Seclusion, ooh, that's creepy, Angel's Tomb, and the rare is Lunar Mystic, Creature Human Wizard 2 2 for 4. Whenever you cast an instant spell, you may pay one if you do draw a card. And a bit about miracles here, so the miracle is a mechanic in the set. And a mountain, okay. Final pack here for you, Mad Bra 99. Let's hope we can get something other than an Eula, that bear there, because that's not the best. Starting off here with Ephemerate. Blade Back Sliver. Very cool, love the Sliver artwork. And actually, we reviewed the uh, Sliver box, there was one, uh, it was years and years ago, and I'll pop a link up in the corner to that. Old foil cards, fantastic set. Fairy Seer, Trustworthy Scout, What I Witch, Goblin Shaman. Okay, so the, the goblin voice doesn't work so well with that one. Prohibit, Igneous Elemental Shelter, Nature's Chant, and Uncommon's Oniru Phage, I think that's how you say it. Vespalark. Munitions Expert Creature Goblin. And the rare is Altar of Dementia. Artifact for two, Sacrifice Creature. Target player puts a number of cards equal to the Sacrifice Creature's power from the top of their library into their graveyard. Not bad. And a foil, Etchings of the Chosen. Very nice foiling on that one. You also get a snow-covered island. Something of something. Force of Despair, yes. And a zombie token. Alright, so there we are. New Mad Bra 99. Let's uh, put this stuff into your envelope. Thank you once again for being a patron. Long-time patron here. Much appreciated. Moving on. We have Emblazoned Aegis. Thank you for being a patron, sir. We are going to do our best to get the crazy pulls today. Let's see what we get in this second box, and I can guarantee there's at least one or two angels in here, including the token. There may be more, we shall see. Dominaria, Corset 2020, War of the Spark. Ooh, that's spicy. Bruna. An angel token, Journey into Nix, Everson Restored, and Modern Horizons. So again, we'll do that last. Let's do this first. Got some decent selection here today. So something like that. And we already looked at the angel token, so we won't worry about that one. And looking at the very nice foil mythic. 
Bruna Light of Alabaster. Look at that glow there. Very cool. Legendary Creature Angel 5546. It's flying and vigilance. Whenever it attacks or blocks, you may attach to it any number of auras on the battlefield. You may put onto the battlefield attached to it any number of aura cards that could enchant it from your graveyard and or hand. Alright, so nice pull for you, sir. Let's put that aside. And get cracking. Avison restored. Here we go again. We seem to get more um, zombies and demons and things here than angels, but maybe our luck will change in this second pack here for the video. Starting off with Dangerous Wager. Outwit. Hunted Ghoul Creature Zombie. That is some pretty creepy artwork there. Spectral Gate Guards. Terrifying Presence. Fervent Cathar. Defang. Ghost Form. Pillar of Flame. Crippling Chill. Uncommon's Ghostly Touch. Wolfear Avenger. Reign of Thorns. And the Rare. Oh! Ding, 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 ding! Mythic, it's Grizzlebrand, legendary creature demon 7748. With flying and lifelink, pay seven life, draw seven cards. Look at that. Craziness, speaking of the demon there. And human and an island token. Or an island, basic land island. Okay, moving on, journey into next. So we've got the crazy mythic pool here already from Blazing Aegis. I'm going to call that a win. Next up we have Humbler of Mortals. Font of Return, Aerial Formation, Magma Spray, Eagle of the Watch, Stonewise Fortifier, Triton Shorestalker, Renowned Weaver, Blade Tusk Boar, Cruel Feeding, Uncommon's Relic of Abandon, Agent of Erebos, Blinding Flare, and rare is Hypnotic Siren. Enchantment Creature Siren 1-1 one, one for a single blue. Is bestow 5 and 2 blue. If you cast this card for its bestow cost, it's an aura spell with enchant creature. Becomes a creature again if it's not attached to a creature. Is flying, you control enchanted creature. Enchanted creature gets plus 1, plus 1 and has flying. Alright, planes and what is this about? Heroic abilities. Okay, next, War of the Spark. We start off, yes, the Goblin Assault Team Creature Goblin Warrior, yes, good to see the Goblins, Ironclad Crivod, Vampire Opportunist, Steady Aim, Lazatep Reaver, and these cards really feel sandpapery, a big contrast to that last pack, Defiant Strike, Erratic Visionary, Guild Globe, Chandra's Pyrohelix, Unlikely Aid, Uncommon Cyclops Electromancer, Bolt Bend, Bond of Insight, and the rare, yes! Tamiyo, Collector of Tales, I journey plans walker, Tamiyo, 5 loyalty for 4. Spells and abilities your opponent's control can't cause you to discard cards or sacrifice permanents. A plus 1, choose a non-land card name and reveal the top 4 cards of your library. Put all cards with the chosen name from among them into your hand and rest into your graveyard. Minus 3 return target card from your graveyard to your hand. Very nice pull there, and a mountain, and a servo token. So we are halfway through, on to Corset 2020. We have Ripscale Predator, Disenchant, Moat Piranhas, Fire Elemental, Greenwood Sentinel, Blade Brand, Prismite, Pacifism, Befuddle, Centaur Corsa, Uncommon's God's Willing, Vampire of the Dire Moon, Cerulean Drake, and the rare is Glinthorn Buccaneer, Creature Minotaur Pirate 2 4 for 3. With haste, whenever you discard a card, Glinthorn Buccaneer deals 1 damage from each opponent well, for 1 and a red. Discard a card, you get to draw a card, activate this ability only if Glinthorn Buccaneer is attacking. And a planes and a wolf token on to Dominaria. Is a Dominaria your favourite set? I think a lot of people really love this one when it came out. Going back to where it all began. Okay, next. We got Healing Grace, Frenzied Rage, Telerian Scholar, Adventurous Impulse, Cabal Paladin, Academy Journey Mage, Tragic Poet, Vicious Offering, Short Sword, Killed an Overseer, 
and uncommons. We have one of these nice enchantment sagas. So these are coming back in Theros Beyond Death. Song of Freyalise, Sage of Latnam, and the rare is Hinterland Harbour. Enters about a full tap unless you control a forest or an island. You can tap it for green or blue, not bad. And the legendary creature is Slindvoda the Rising Deep with an island and sapling. And I think some of the patrons were saying they had uh, built a Slindvoda EDH deck. So is that something you have tried out? Leave a note in the comments. Okay, final pack here. Modern Horizons for Emblazoned Aegis. Good luck, sir. And stay tuned. Christmas Day, we're going to have a very nice video indeed. Something I've been looking forward to for a very long time, but the packs are astonishingly difficult to find. So looking forward to that. Final pack here, we have Phantom Ninja, Imposter of the Sixth Pride, Spinehorn Minotaur, Spore Frog, Pyrophobia, Windcaller Avon, Return from Extinction, Crozan Tusker, Iceberg Cancrix, Uncommon's Twisted Reflection, Feaster of Fools, Wall of Blossoms, and the rare is Nether Spirit. Creature Spirit, 2-2 two, two for 3 at the beginning of your upkeep. If Nether Spirit is the only creature card in your graveyard, you may return Nether Spirit to the battlefield. I just like saying that. And that has some rather creepy artwork as well. So there we go. Oh, you also get a Foil Ice Hide Golem. And a Snow Covered Plains. A Eula Queen Among Bears. Is that a Eula? Yes, it is. Yes. And a Goblin Token Non-Foil. All right, so there we have it. Emblazoned Aegis. Very nice pull here with the Grizzle Brand, sir. So we'll pop these into your envelope. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Thanks for watching and have a great day.